Well, hello, Advent. So glad that you're joining us on this 40 days of prayer. Today, our scripture verse comes from Revelation chapter 22, verse 13. I am the Alpha and the Omega, the first and the last, the beginning and the end. Of course, this is Jesus speaking, and we see how he is right there from the start to the finish, before we were even born, when we were in our mother's wombs. He knew us, he formed us, he made us, and he'll be with us. Uh, we'll be with him until the very end of the ages, and we can thank God for that. Um, our prayer tip this week is to uh, consider the Lord's Prayer and how it can lead us into prayer. And so I'm going to use that format as we pray in just a minute. Uh, we also are to think of those that are in hunger in ways that we feed them, uh, such as through the New Manum ministry. Also, uh, we think of widows, of widowers, those who have lost loved ones, and we pray for them. So let us now pray. Lord and God, we come before you acknowledging you as the first and the last, the Alpha, the Omega. You are our Father in heaven, and yet you are close and with us right here. And Father, we desire that your kingdom come. We desire that your will be done in this world and in our very lives and our hearts. And we come before you asking uh, for our daily bread, but more than that, to feed others. And we ask, Lord, that you be with those who are widows, widowers. Lord, there are so many who have lost loved ones, especially those in the last year with COVID. And Lord, we pray that you be clo close to those uh, in their grief and sorrow, that you would bring them comfort. Lord, we ask that you forgive us of our sins. Help us to forgive those who have sinned against us. And Lord, we pray that you would indeed uh, lead us not into temptation, but you would help us uh, to avoid all that is sinful because, Lord, we desire to glorify you and honor you in our lives. We pray all this in Jesus' name. Amen. Have a great day.